Hi, my name is Julian Aftis. I'm the new director of the Science Academy at Park Shore Country Day Camp. Uh, we're going to practice science in a way that's never been practiced before. I've been teaching science for 20 years. I'm a high school physics teacher, and I've taught earth science and chemistry and biology. I've taught every discipline in the scientific area, including middle school. Science is about kids investigating, and that's what we're going to do at Park Shore. We're going to investigate the nature of the world, of the universe, figure out how things work, ask good questions, hypothesize, test our hypothesis, try to figure out how things behave so that we'll know how we know that anything in this world is true. Because that's what science is. Science is about knowledge. Science tells us how we know things are true. We're building a unique facility at Park Shore. We're going to have four classrooms, but although they're separate spaces, they're interdisciplinary. We're going to be studying in the four classrooms robotics, engineering, physical science, and life science. But we'll talk about how those disciplines come together through a real kind of thread of energy. We'll use the idea of energy flowing through the ecosystem to kind of build a holistic model of the way the universe works. Talking about how energy from our sun gives energy to our plants. It sounds like the circle of life, but it really is. And that's how everything works. It works on a, on a system of exchanging energies. So if kids begin to investigate that and see it happening across different disciplines, they can begin to make those connections. They can begin to see that. We're going to have a 15-acre laboratory where we can explore the, the woods, the grasses, the, the, the water. We, we've got all of this great facility at our disposal, equipment, tools. We're going to make sure that kids understand that science is about asking questions. The buzzword today in education is STEM. STEM stands for Science, Technology, Engineering, and Mathematics. At the heart of our STEM program is going to be robots. We're going to use Lego robotics programs. Kids will learn to program the robots on a computer. They'll learn to manipulate them. They'll learn how the sensors work. They'll figure out how a robot figures out its environment through sensors. Over time, they'll be building more and more sophisticated software into their robot so that the robot can find its way in the dark. It can find its way on walls. It can find its way with sound. Robots can behave to their environment because they have these sensors, just like we have senses, just like we have ears and eyes and, and all of our human senses. In our engineering program, kids are going to do authentic engineering design. They're really going to think about how do we solve problems like an engineer. The engineering process involves testing hypotheses, much like a scientist, but it's then figuring out a solution. And when the solution doesn't work, you redesign and you redesign until you get something that really works. That's what engineers do. They solve problems. So in our engineering classroom, kids are going to build things like windmills and water pumps. They're going to figure out the way that machines work. Not only are we going to learn a lot of science, we're going to have a ton of fun. Science is fun. I mean, let's figure out things like, why is ice cream so cold? Why does it taste cold? We'll make ice cream and eat it. We'll think about getting down and dirty in the mud. Why do those creatures crawl and live there? We're going to get messy, because science is messy. That's the way it is. But we're going to also have a very serious product at the end of the summer. After eight weeks of investigating, our kids are going to put together a laboratory notebook that they can go back to again and again. They can continue their experiments on their own, on their own. They can go back and look at them when they're working in school. They're going to learn so much about science that that notebook itself is going to be a valuable tool for them for the rest of their lives. I can't wait for summer at Park Shore. We're going to have the most amazing experience. Your child's really going to learn a lot. And I'm really looking forward to being there with them. So thanks for listening.